Hello and welcome back to Brass Brigade. Today we're going to be taking a look at the brand new update that has just come out for it and it is the special weapons and special forces update for Brass Brigade and I'm not going to lie, it looks pretty awesome. So the objective of this new map called Norway is basically you have to push up and capture this airfield right here, then push up to that site, that V2 rocket down there and then eventually you got to get down to the docks, dock 1 and dock 2 which are the U-boats. So we've got to take the airfield, then the V2 rocket and then the docks and the boys are already moving in. Now the unit that I've chosen here is the Royal Commando and it has been updated it's now got an impact grenade so if I press G you'll see on impact that will blow up and yes I did just team kill but it was worth it to show you what it was and also it has a silent Sten gun as its primary and it is pretty awesome oh my god there's a flak 88 right there we're gonna have to deal with that nice and quickly or can we actually take this position in fact let's just jump on the flak 88 let's just use their guns against them come on spin it round spin it round spin it round where are they at hello sir no I was so close Oh my god, look at that. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna shoot it up there. Oh look at that. It's just a nice vehicle, isn't it? If you guys didn't know, the Flak 88 was originally supposed to be well, it's a Flak 88 is originally supposed to be um, an anti-aircraft gun, hence why it's called Flak. And then some genius figured out, hold on a second, if we point this down and shoot it at tanks, turns out it works pretty well. <laughs> So that's how it became an anti-tank gun as well as a, uh, an anti-aircraft gun. Okay, we are in this building. Can I get upstairs? Is there anyone upstairs? Oh my god, yep, there's someone upstairs. <laughs> he was camping the stairs. These AI man are absolutely brutal. He was camping. I just need to find a way of getting around. Also, can I say these watchtowers, they look pretty epic right here. They do look really epic. And these little, I don't even know what you call these, little patrol house things. Okay, hold on. Oh, hold on. Hold on a second. No! 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 I can't! Oh my god. Three hit points. I could not get away from that. There was no getting away from that. Okay, come on. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna have to step out and take the shot. Yes! Look at that! Oh! <laughs> I thought I got him. Oh, we both got each other. Okay, fair play. Oh god, you see that? There's a V2 rocket coming in. There's a V2 rocket coming in. Where is it going to? I'm inside, so hopefully I'm gonna be safe from it. But you can see it. Where is it going? Oh my god, that is absolutely epic. You can see it flying in from absolutely ages away. I've got to say, that is a pretty cool addition to the game. And so far, this little Brass Brigade uh, Secret Weapons and Special Forces update uh, is pretty fun. I should play this game more often. I haven't played this game nearly enough. So guys, once again, if you are new to the channel, you want to see more of this kind of stuff, and you are enjoying Brass Brigade, please do comment down below and like the video. Let me know if you want to see more of it, because realistically, if a video does well, then I do it again. That's basically how I, how I, oh god, how I plan and do videos. Oh god, I've not reloaded it. Oh, that is some terrible timing. There's a stug. What is it? Let's see. What type of stug is it? Okay, come on. Surely he's getting, it is a stug three? It is a stug three. I can confirm that is a stug three. Where is he? Oh god. Oh, it's ours. It's ours. It's ours. It's okay. It's ours. I'm gonna jump into it. I'm gonna jump into it. Thank you for your services. Thank you for delivering me this vehicle. I am going to take it to the enemy right now. And we're going to hopefully break in. I want to... So we've taken the airfield. We've taken a submarine pen. Uh, what I want to do is I want to break down into the U-boat area. Is that dead? Is this stug dead? It's hard to tell with these. Because obviously it's not got a turret that blows off. So it's difficult to tell. Okay, what is this one right here? It is the supply depot. Let's try and take this to supply depot. Oh my god, there's a panzer right there. Look how many men were just sitting there. Oh my god, that is a lot of German men. Oh my god, look at these guys. What is happening? What is happening to these guys? Oh, I should have got into the Panzer IV. I should have got into the Panzer... Oh! That'll do it. <laughs> that will do it. Turns out getting shot by a Flak 88 in a tin can is going to take you out. Oh god, no, I can hear another V2 rocket. I can hear another V2 rocket. Where is it going? Where is it going? Look at that. Oh god, it's coming down. Where is it going? <laughs> oh, look at that. Okay, we're going back for the Royal Commando, boys, because it seems to be the one, the only one, rather, that I actually seem to be able to do anything with. It does seem like a pretty good unit. He's got a health pack, he's got some impact grenades. Seems like a fairly well-rounded unit. What I want to do is I want to go upstairs here and absolutely clean out this building from the guys who I know will be camping these top stairs. Oh, okay, no. <laughs> You see, I was shooting before I even got up there because I was so sure they were going to be there. Okay, so we've taken town. Oh my god, was that the Flak 88 again? That thing is the bane of my life. That thing is absolutely wrecking me. What I need to do is I need to get myself a Royal Sharpshooter and I'm going to get onto it. I'm going to spawn straight back in. Oh, right, he's down here somewhere. Oh, it's down. It's down. It's down. The Flak 88 has been removed from the game. 
Good job, boys. Oh, did we get that kill? There we go. Get some. Okay, we got barracks. Now that we're moving up closer quarters, I'm going to move back to the Royal Commando once again. Oh, the Flak 88 has respawned. Can I come over the hills? No, I... Can I go over the hills? Because, obviously, we're going down to the U-boat uh, dock down there. We've got all of these flags right here. Have we taken a supply depot? We're actually doing it. But can I be really jammy here and run right over the top and drop down onto them? This is what I want to know. Oh, it doesn't look like it. It doesn't look like it. What about around this side? Oh, hold on a second. Maybe we can. What about what's that down there? What's that down here? Can I... Oh, my God. We almost... Oh, my God. We almost did that, though. We almost did that. We almost did that. You know what? That's actually worth trying again. I actually almost pulled that off. If you, like, drop down and then come back in at the right time, I reckon you can cheese your way into that base nice and easy. So if I drop down left and then I come left... No! I almost got it. Okay, I won't try that again. I won't try it again, but I think you might be able to do that. Okay, what I might do is I might just come around the corner. Impact grenade in. Oh, okay! My impact grenade hit the guy right in front of me and killed me. Look how many Germans are coming out of there. Oh my god, we need, I need to spawn quickly and get them before, because if all those guys flood out, they might be able to retake that position. Okay, look at that guy trying to crawl out. No! Oh, there was another guy? They're hiding in the corpses. They're hiding in the pile of corpses. Oh, there's a side door? I didn't realize there was a side door. Look at that, they've got a side door and all. Let's see, there's gonna be- Oh! <laughs> oh, good night to me, Panzer Shrek to the face. This is the first time I've got down to this bit right here, look at this. Okay, I think we now need to go down the stairs to the submarine base. I'm not gonna lie, the progression- Oh, sorry, mate! Oh, why were you coming up? Why were you coming up? Okay, come on, come on. Oh, look at that, okay, I'm gonna- Come on, boys, I need a hand here. Boys, get in there. I need a hand. Okay, you can take the shot. Oh, did he get him? Oh, I keep team killing. I keep doing some really bad team kills. Oh, my God. This is actually so close. This is actually nerve-wrackingly close. This is a very well-balanced one. Oh, my God. Look at the boys, though. Come on, we got a squad here. Come on, boys. Move out, move out, move out. The British Special Forces are moving. Oh, the British Special Forces all got killed by one guy. <laughs> well, oh, my God. That guy's slithering up the hill. Come on, come on. No! They've got no they've got no redeploys, okay? So we're gonna be fighting they're the last man here. They have zero redeploys, and we've only got seven redeploys. Uh, thankfully I am one of them, so I now need to use this life carefully, because if I lose this life, then I might I won't be respawning! Oh come on, no, I need to respawn quick! Come on! Don't no! Oh, come on, come on, come on, let me respawn, let me respawn, let me respawn. No, I'm not respawning anymore. Hold on, we've got some redeploys because we captured a flag. We've got some redeploys because we got a flag. Is that a German? It is a German. It is a German. We got the German. Okay, I'm hiding in a corner just like any good special forces uh, Brit would do. Come on, corner boy. Look at him trying to drop shot me. I won't have... Oh, no. Come on. Am I going to lose my redeploy again because of that? We've run out of steam, boys. We've run out of steam. This is one of the last British troopers in here, I think. Oh, no. We have run out of steam at the last hurdle, I don't believe it. And now the Germans are going to be left. And look, you can see them slowly pushing up. There's not many of them. But they're going to slowly start drip feeding in and capturing some more of these flags. Okay, I think the Brits have lost that one. What I'm going to do now is I want to jump onto the German side so that I can see the STG-44s with scopes. And see what's changed in the update for the German side. And also just see their perspective on this map. Okay, this time I'm going to spawn in as the shock trooper we're playing as the Germans. I'm going to supply... I'm going to drop, rather, at the dock and run all the way up just so I can show you guys. Because obviously, as the Brits in the last battle. I did not manage to win it, unfortunately. So as you can see, there are two U-boats right here, which is really, really cool. Really well done. You see, there's one there as well. Uh, and this is where we were trying to fight. So again, you've got to take out the airfield, and then you've got to work your way down to uh, taking out the the uh, the V2 rocket. And then finally down here, unfortunately, I did not manage that with the British commandos. Now this Brass Brigade Special Weapons and Special Forces uh, update has brought some changes, even to the SDG-44 and the Shock Troopers. So as you can see, if I had pressed Q, I would be able to call in a V2 rocket. But I also have a scoped STG-44, which is pretty epic in itself, to be honest. Okay, we have made contact with the enemy. I'm going to press Q right there. Okay, that is where I'm putting my V2 rocket, which hopefully I'm going to be able to see from somewhere. Where is it coming? There it is. That's the V2 rocket I've just called in as a shock trooper. And look at that. I just got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine kills with one V2 rocket. And the cooldown 
isn't even that small on it. Like, it, it's sorry, isn't even that big, rather. I can call in one of those again in another couple of seconds. Also, let's just see how this STG-44 is. Oh, this STG is nice with a scope on it. Look at that. I will say I've got excellent view on, uh, well, down there. There we go, look at that. Can we call it down on a tank? Can we just, can I just call it in on that Sherman? Oh, oh my god, call it in, just call it in. No, I'm dead. Oh, I got sniped, I got sniped. I want to get on that flak 88. Oh no, I didn't see him. Yeah, airfield entrance. Here we go, I'm going to spawn at the airfield entrance. And I'm going to try and see if I can get my way over onto that flak. Okay, come on. Run, 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 run. I want to get onto the flak 88 and actually be in a position to use it well. No! Oh, a little camping sniper at the back. Look at him. However, I know where he is. He's literally just there. <laughs> Sorry, mate. You as well. Won't be having any of that. Thank you very much. Now that we've got those guys killed, should we go back for the flak 88? I think so. I think that's what we do. Oh my god, that was one there? I'm gonna get myself over onto that flak 88 and lay down some hurt onto the enemy, hopefully, uh, before getting killed. Okay, what's this just around to my left? What is that? That's what I'm talking about. This guy right here. Come on, can we get another shot off? Come on, one more shot, one more shot. Imagine if I actually get a kill in this thing after all this time. Oh my god, this Sherman is an absolute monster. Or is it driven? Oh no, okay, we got him. Okay, I was gonna say, I wasn't sure if it was like driven by one of them or what was the deal there, because that took four hits in a flak 88. I can hear a V2 rocket. That's what I can hear. I'm gonna call in my own V2 rocket right there. And then we're gonna jump back into this V2. Am I in the kill distance for that actually? Because I don't know what the kill distance is. Uh, I mean, I know it's quite big. Let's watch this. Let's watch this. Okay, this we need to get that guy real quick. Let's watch this V2 rocket. There's nobody even there. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh, it was not worth it. I got like two kills off of that. Okay, we're gonna try the sharpshooter, which I think probably means sharpshooter. There we go. Look at that. I figured something out. Let's see what this gun looks like. And if I go in and press T, uh, yeah, it's the same scope, but it does look pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, we're really pushing them back, though. We're really pushing... Oh, my God. Look at the rate of fire on that. Look at that guy snaking over the airfield. He was snaking over the airfield. I've got to admit, I really like this semi-automatic. Oh, what's that down there? That looks like a tank of some sort. That looks like a tank. It's very far. I can't really see what I'm even shooting at, to be honest with you. But it looks like there's a tank down there through the woods. You can see that? You see the muzzle flash? Okay. Oh, my God. Did he get me? I could barely even see him and he just absolutely wrecked me. Oh, they're down to zero redeploys. They're down to zero redeploys. So we have pushed them back. We have held them off. They are not going to be redeploying any more units. So this definitely is easier as the Germans, which I guess makes sense. It makes it a challenge, which I like. And that was possibly a team kill. Don't look at me, Mr. Cromwell. There's nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. What's my secondary, actually? Oh, no, I've not got anything I can do to deal with him, really, to be honest. I'm just gonna have to hope that somebody else does. Okay, I got a V2 rocket. Stay still. Please stay still. I got a V2 rocket coming in, boys. I got a V2 rocket coming down on that Cromwell. Please stay still. No, please stay still. Oh, come on. Go back into it. Go back into it. You know you want to. Oh, it just missed. That's so odd. And then he shot me down. What an absolute heartbreak. Oh, the Flak 88 is operational. The Flak 88 is operational, but let's just use the Panzer Shrek once. Panzer Shrek once, and then let's jump onto the Flak 88, and there we go. Revenge at last. That is it for today's episode, folk. I hope you enjoyed that uh, that update for Brass Brigade, the special weapons uh, and special forces uh, update for Brass Brigade. I've got to admit, I think that is pretty awesome. I had a really, really good time playing that. Now, folks, once again, if you have not already subscribed to the channel and you did enjoy that, please consider subscribing. I do a lot of battle simulator games on this channel. If you want to see my previous uh, Brass Brigade video, there'll be a card in the top right corner of the screen. I did a bridge too far. It was pretty awesome. You should definitely go check it out. And once again, if you want to see more of this, be sure to like and comment on the video because that's how I know if you guys are liking it uh, and whether or not I should do it again. But thank you very much for watching. I will catch you again next time.